What's going on guys, Ooh. Dorko back again, hope you are fantastic today, and welcome to a FNAF fan game called The Perfect Pet. Now this is a FNAF fan game based on Fetch, the dog, the good little doggo. So I'm looking forward to this because we don't really get any fan games based on the story, so yeah. And let's get straight into it guys, here we go. Oh. Fetch is your new gaming best friend. This is a new toy from the creators of Freddy Fazbear Pete. Hello, this Fetch. toy can walk and run very fast like a real dog. <laughs> because of this, you can safely play catch up with him. Oh, Fetch can play hears catch. your commands very well. You can give him a command and he will do it. Give him he commands. also has a very good grip to easily pick up items that he wants to bring you. Are you afraid that you will not be seen in the dark? Okay, he sees in the right. dark. Fetch sees everything perfect in the dark no matter what. Get it now for dollar one hundred point nine nine at Freddy Fazbear Pete's. And to don't fair, forget to... That's not that bad. Hundred dollars. Hello? <laughs> Who the hell are you? Oh, is that supposed to be like the stitch rifle or something? Maybe. Okay. Did we buy a doggo? At Freddy Fazbear's Pizza? I have no idea. I'm scared. So I'm pretty sure Fetch is going to try and murder us. Oh, hello. How to play? Click on the room so that a flashlight glows. Okay. Oh, wow. Look at this. Ah! What the heck? I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. Um, there is a bed behind you. What? I'm, I don't know what I'm doing here. Do I just ignore him? I don't know. I'm just going to be... It's plush trap. Hi. Oh my god, that's so cute. Okay, well, it's like a FNAF 4 bedroom then. Oh, oh my god, fl Fetch, you seem to be flashing a little bit. Are you okay? <laughs> Fetch. Okay, well, I've got a bug already. That's not a good start, is it? Oh my god, what? I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this thing. I don't know. I can't go back to the bed. So I guess I. Oh my god. Ah! Okay, well, that was, uh, eventful. I think it's the stitch rife, but I don't know. And then there's a plush trap chaser and fetch, so it makes sense, right, that that would be stitch rife or something. So I don't think I'm supposed to flash my light at stitch rife. Um, I've got to survive till 6 a.m., so, okay. It looks better now, because the, the door's not glitching now. So I think it's fixed. There you go. Yeah! What the dog doing? Hello, Fetch. Are you going to leave? Okay, so Fetch is like... Yeah, Fetch comes and says hello. We flash the light. He disappears. Plus trap. We just have to wait. Uh, keep pushing him back. And make him sit nice and cozy back on the bed. And then Stitch Rafe. Uh, we just don't flash our light. And we just... Wait. But that is the most terrifying thing I've ever seen. And look at all the hands and stuff. What do I do? I don't... What do I do if Stitch Rife's there? Okay. We're fine. Oh my god. You stay there, buddy. Keep an eye on Fetch. Okay. Oh god. Hi! Get back there, boy! Go on! Thank you. Stitch Rife, man. Stitch Rife is the most terrifying thing in this. It's pretty cool, though. We got a... a we finally got a freaking... Oh, okay. I only got a, a fan game based on the book characters. Okay, I yeah, I don't think I can have the lights on anywhere in when he's there. So if they both appear at the same time, what do I do? If Fetch and Stitch Ray are both there, you stay back. Go on. Go on. Hold on, let me throw a dog toy at you. Go on. Go fetch. Okay. Yeah, so this is pretty simple, to be fair. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's simple, but it's it's pretty fun. I like it. <laughs> I didn't just buy Fetch. I also bought a Plus Trap Chaser. So this is going really well for me. Um, It doesn't look like he's got any human remains inside, like human eyeballs. So I don't think it's the Plus Trap Chaser. 
But, I mean, he's trying to murder me, so... Or, or is he? He might be just friendly. I don't know. Okay. 2 am, guys. Also, I've noticed at the top right there's a red dot. So, I don't know if that's a camera. Somebody's watching me. Back up. Okay. Oh, my God. Fetch is being very aggressive. So, yeah, you can see it's got some FNAF 4 vibes to it. Um, but it all look, it look, it looks nice. I don't know if it's just these three or something else later on. Okay. And this is what I was worried about. It's, it's terrifying. Absolutely terrifying. I'm going to have nightmares about that tonight, I think. <laughs> it reminds me of, like, the FNAF VHS. You know, the eyes. You know what I'm talking about, right? What you see on Chica and stuff. The classic Squimpus McGrimpus types, etc. The creepy eyes on the animatronics. Uh, we, we're doing good, though. It's four, I yet. I jinxed it. Stay back. You can have fetch. Go and get him. Oh, what do I do now? What do I do now with the both here? Hello? I'm dead. I think, uh... Hello? I'm going to get killed by plush trap. Oh my god! Oh my god! Holy crap! <laughs> I thought that was going to be a jump scare then. Oh, wow. Okay, that scared me. I thought that was the jump scare. God. Stitch drive. Go away. Thank you. That was really close, man. Go on. Go back and sit down. So, it's until 6am. We're at 4am. Don't want to jinx it. 5am. I really don't want uh, Stitch Drive to ruin my plans of getting out of here. Go on, boy. I'll, I'll give you some dog treats later on. Okay. Almost there, guys. 5am. We're doing really good. Okay, and you're back. Just before 6am. I don't hear a door creaking. We're good. Okay, back up. I think we've got this, guys. Unless Stitch Drive just ruins it at the last second. But I think this is looking good. Uh, don't tell me he's just come back. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Oh, no! I'm dead! I'm dead. I'm going to get killed by Plush Trap. I told you, guys. I told you. Oh my god, okay. If if it was a little bit longer then, I definitely would have got killed. 100% would have got murdered by Plus Trap. Damn, but we did it. Nice. Oh, it's done. Oh, okay. Thanks for playing. This game turned out to be short and easy. But this is all due to the fact that this is one of my first FNAF projects. The game was created just for the sake of just showing you the game and what I can do. Look forward to future projects that will be better than the perfect pet. Um, developer, I really hope you keep doing fan games based on Fazbear Frights because it looks like you had something here that was cooking up to be something really fun. Um, that was still a nice little demo. I'd call it a demo, really. Showcasing what a game could be like with uh, the Fazbear Fright characters. I'm still hoping somebody does something like that later on, like a full-on Fazbear Fright uh, fan game. But we unlocked bonus content. Okay, well, Fetch is dead. I mean, that's a bit mean. <laughs> I was going to give him dog treats later on, but no, you just ripped his face off. So this is the room. Got characters here. Oh, my God, Fetch. Hello. <laughs> Fetch looks weird standing up, doesn't he? He looks, he looks better sat down compared to him standing up with his tail. Uh, but this is Fetch. Okay. Oh, it... The maca macabre marionette. Oh, so it wasn't Stitch Rife. It was like a puppet with like... It looks like it's got human organs in and stuff. Yeah, I thought that was Stitch Rife, honestly. I really did. Um, it goes with the... It goes with Fetch and Fazbear Frights. But no, it's um, macabre marionette. Um, I still think it's Stitch Rife. Let's just say it's Stitch Rife. Human organ, Springtrap style puppet. The face is terrifying, by the way. The face is so creepy. You can actually zoom in as well, which is really cool. That face, man. It's terrifying. It's actually...
actually terrifying. I don't like it. It's just staring in my soul right now. Um, and we got the spring body toy. So it wasn't a... It, I still think it's plus trap chaser. It still works. Oh, here are the jump scares. We saw the puppet one. We're going to see fetches and plus traps in game. I'll get the jump scares with... Oh my god, there's two. Wow, that's cool. Two jump scares of plus trap. Behind the scenes of making the jump scare. Very cool. There's fetch. Okay. <laughs> oh, got additional renders of the puppet. Plus trap chaser and fetch. Oh, look. The puppet was actually behind there, apparently. Did I see him? And that. Okay. Come on, then. Let's go and see the other jump scares. Let's get murdered by plus trap and fetch. Fetch. Oh, my God. He was there, but he didn't kill me. Edge, what is going on? Can you leave me alone, please? Thank you. Okay, Fetch is there right now. Oh, my God. Okay, we just got killed by a trap with no sound. <laughs> okay, so there's a few there's a few little bugs in this, to be fair. That was plus traps jump scare without the noise. We'll just have to make our own. Look at that guys. That is terrifying. Absolutely terrifying. Okay, we're gonna get killed by Yeah, we did. So I think something's wrong with the jump scares when you're about to get killed by something. Um the music just stops. <laughs> Guys, I have to do it again. Uh, let's never do that again. Okay, guys, that was the perfect pet. It had something there, and the developer did say this is his first fan game. And I really do appreciate anybody who decides to make a FNAF fan game based on Fazbear Frights because there's so much potential for it. If you want to check it out, I will put a link in the description. Thank you so much for watching. Take care, lots of love. And I'll see you all next time.